David Nancy here at Porsche Colorado Springs coming at you with this beautiful 2011 uh, 911 Turbo S. It is silver and it does have a clear bra 24 inches up the front. Let's do a little walk around and take a peek at her, okay? All right, so yep, clear bra. I'm going to go ahead and go kind of slowly here. Obviously, there are that's dirt, by the way, right there. There's always going to be a little rock chips, um, even on the clear bra. Hopefully, they don't go through to the paint. But so far, nothing is jumping out at me. Even under the clear bra, it looks really nice and clean. Bottom lip looks good. Yep, that looks good. And then, let's see. Yeah, it looks really good. I can't even see any rock chips in the clear bra. It looks great. I don't see any dings or dents. Let's take a look at all of the wheels. I'm sorry, we do get snow here and so it could be a tiny bit cleaner in the breezeway. All right, so we've got a clear bra right here on the side mirror. This all looks great. Looks really good. All right, you've got the, uh, the clear uh, part that comes back from the factory standard little scuff on this wheel right here. We do have wheel people that come around so I can get that touched up for sure. That's very, 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 very minor though. As you can see, this car just came in. That's why there's no pictures online. We still have a license plate here. <laughs> so we will get it detailed and clean up. So we're looking at her without even being touched, really, just fresh trade in. looks great. This is always a good way to tell how it was cared for. Little tiny scratch right there. That, oh, that, that's a very much a surface scratch. That can just come right off, I think, with a buff. Another little nick in this wheel right here on the back uh, passenger side. Again, that's easy, easy. Get that touched up. Clear bra again. And this wheel looks great. All right, let's take a peek at the inside. All right, we've got Turbo S and stainless steel there on the door sill. You've got your 14-way power seats. The seats look great. I don't see any wear on the bolsters. The dash looks great. Sorry, Siri's talking to me. <laughs> Stop eavesdropping, Siri. Okay, uh, PDK transmission. Beautiful, all right. Leather on the back of the seats, it looks great. It looks brand new. I wouldn't even believe this was a 2011. I know we've got some bright sun right there. Let's try to, sorry about that. I'm gonna take it from the other side too so you can see better. I mean, the leather looks, look at the leather on the center console. It looks beautiful, really good. Bose sound system, doors look great. Let's go around the driver's side here for you. All right, love the white instrument cluster. 94,776 miles on the odometer. We're certifying it. How do you like that? Seat settings one, two, and three. And as you would expect with um, a car with almost 100,000 miles on it, there's going to be some kind of wear somewhere. Here's the one place I found some wear. <laughs> right there. Okay, that's it. I mean, for 100,000 miles, this looks immaculate. It has no weird smells. People ask me that. It looks beautiful. I mean, all the leathers and. <laughs> They kept really good care of this. Again, it almost really looks new on the inside. Like I said, the only only thing I can spot is a little chip right here. I would do a little touch-up paint right there. Um, get some silver touch-up paint. And then this right here is just peeling off. I don't really know if that piece can be replaced, but it's so minor. I'm sure there's probably something that you can do to make it look better. But again, I'm being really picky because you can't be here in person, okay? I'm gonna go ahead and start this baby up for you next. 